great to see so many people here tonight. I hope you have some doozy questions coming out. Just the fun part of the evening. Uh, my name is John Gillen and I'm chair of the Greenfield Community Board. In this election I'm standing for the Kaipataki Local Board, which is replacing the Greenfield and Burgundy and North Coast Community Boards. Um, and the, community, the Kaipataki Local Board will be your local board, it will be your link to the new council. It's very important. Now, I'm a local man, I've lived almost all my life on the North Shore. I've lived in Hillcrest, Greenfield, Wairau, Chatsworth, Birkdale, and had a business in Beach Haven. I'm independent, unlike others um, that are aligned to parties that just popped up over the last few weeks. Um, now, if you haven't got one of my pamphlets, I left one on all the chairs, but I've got more down the back. The reason I say this is that there's much more information in here um, about my achievements and my policies than I could possibly talk about tonight. So please pick one up if you don't really have one. Just a couple of questions, I've, a couple of issues that I'd like to quickly go over. Only why I road. Now we found public transport, but we, but we have to change the T3 lane to T2. <coughs> Stop using only my road drivers as cash cows. We need to double lane both ways. We need to remove any on-street parking that's causing problems. No high rises in Highbury. Some of the candidates standing, sitting behind me tonight are actively promoting high rises. Not on my watch. I am against the Eastern Park Parade trial. I'm the only member of the Greenfield Community Board who did not support it. It's expensive, it's dangerous, it'll cause U turns, uh, driver frustration, confusion. However, the residents of Eastern Park Parade do have uh, a few points, and I'd like to propose single lane chicanes speed bumps instead of the speed tables there at the moment, enforcing of a heavy traffic bylaw that already exists, um, and making the road a high, a high priority hot spot for the police. And there should be regular meetings between the local residents and the new Copatiki board just to iron out any problems. <coughs> just, I've, got, I've got a bit of time left, so I'd just like to say that I also promote or support free access to the leisure centre pools for all senior citizens. And that our libraries, which are currently under threat, um, they need to remain open seven days a week. There have been proposals to cut them on Sundays to save money to help pay back um, the costs of the subsidy. And also that the borrowing of library books should remain free. There is one candidate who I know is um, what charges for library book borrowing. I've been instrumental in um, improving playgrounds, particularly in the 